Hello everyone. Welcome to this tutorial on communicating to XPyce using Python. In this tutorial, we will learn introduction to Python, measure AC voltage using plot window and Python, generate a sine wave, measure external and internal voltages using Python, measure capacitance and resistance using plot window and Python, generate a square wave, show connections and circuit diagrams for our experiments. Here I am using XPyce version 3.1.0 Ubuntu Linux OS version 14.10 To follow this tutorial, you should be familiar with XPyce Junior Interface Basic Python Programming If not for relevant tutorials, please visit our website. Let us begin with Introduction to Python Python is simple and easy to learn powerful programming language. It is free and open source cross-platform high-level language. It has effective approach to object-oriented program. Let us make sure that Python is installed on our system. Press Ctrl, Alt and T keys to open the terminal. To start Python interpreter, type Python and press Enter. Details regarding default version of Python will be displayed on the terminal. The displayed three angle brackets indicate Python prompt. Now you are ready to type commands. For more details about Python programming, please visit our website. I will discuss about the channels on the top panel of the device. On the top panel, each terminal is assigned to a specific channel number. For example, channel 1 is assigned to A1 and channel 2 to A2. I will show how to connect wires to the device. Device has screw terminals on either side. To make the connection, we insert wires into the terminals and tighten the screws. Here A2 is connected to sine. This is the circuit diagram. Let us perform an experiment to measure the voltage of A2 and show its sine wave. Let us see the result on the plot window. On the plot window, click on A2 to display the voltage of A2. Voltage of A2 is displayed below. Click on A2 and drag to channel CH1. When we drag A2 to CH1, input data of A2 is assigned to CH1. Move the millisecond per division slider to show the sine wave. Click on A2 to show the change in voltages of A2. Click on CH1 and drag to fit. The voltage and frequency of A2 is displayed on the right. We will perform the same experiment and measure voltage of A2 using Python. Please note to avoid errors on Python interpreter, connect the device to the system. Close the plot window. To import ICE library from XPyce, type at the prompt import xpyce.icej and press enter. Type p equal to xpyce.icej.open and press enter. Open function returns an object if hardware is found. These lines will load the XPyce library and establish connection to the device. To view the voltage of A2, type print p dot get underscore voltage within brackets 2 and press enter. Output shows voltage of A2. Similarly, we can show the various voltages of A2. Voltage of A2 changes as it is an AC voltage. To generate plots using Python interpreter, install Python matplotlib library using Synaptic Package Manager. I have already installed Python matplotlib library on my system. To generate plots on Windows operating system, download and install matplotlib version 1.4.3, numpy version 1.9 or above. Copy the installed XPyce files and drivers and paste in C drive. To generate sine wave, at the Python prompt, type import 
expeyes.isj and press enter. Type p equal to expeyes.isj.open and press enter as before. Type from pylab import asterisk. From pylab import asterisk is a program from matplotlib library. Press enter. Type ion. This command sets pylab interactive mode. Press enter. Type t comma v equal to p dot capture within brackets two comma two hundred comma hundred. T comma v are time and voltage vectors. Two is channel number for A two. Two hundred is the number of data points. Hundred is a time interval. Between subsequent measurements, press enter. To view the output, type plot within brackets t comma v. Plot within brackets t comma v generates a sine wave on a new window. Press enter. We can generate a sine wave using the above commands on Windows command prompt as well. Next, let us measure voltage of A1 using a battery as an external voltage source. To measure external voltage source, ground is connected to A1 through a battery of 3 volt. This is the circuit diagram. We will show the value of A1 using Python interpreter. At the Python prompt, type import expeyes.isj and press enter. Type p equal to expeyes.isj dot open and press enter. Type print p dot get underscore voltage within brackets 1 and press enter. Here channel 1 is assigned to A1. Voltage of A1 is displayed on the terminal. Let us measure voltage of A1 using PVS as internal voltage source. In this experiment PVS is connected to A1 this is the circuit diagram. Back to the terminal. Type print p dot set underscore voltage within brackets 3 and press enter. Here voltage of PVS will be set to 3 volts. Voltage of PVS is displayed. Type print p dot get underscore voltage within brackets 1 and press enter. Voltage of A1 is displayed on the terminal. Now I will demonstrate AC and DC components of a voltage using capacitor and resistor and also generate a square wave. In this experiment A1 is connected to SQR1. SQR1 is connected to A2 through a capacitor. A2 is connected to ground through a 200K resistor. This is the circuit diagram. Let us see the result on the plot window. On the plot window, click on measure C on IN1 button. Capacitance of IN1 is displayed as minus 0 0.6 picofarads. Click on measure R on SEND button. Resistance of SEND is displayed as 560 ohms. Please note, you may get slightly different values of capacitance and resistance. Click on SQ1 and drag to CH1. SQ1 is assigned to channel CH1. Click on A2 and drag to CH2. A2 is assigned to channel CH2. Click on SQR1 checkbox to show the square waves. Move the millisecond per division slider to adjust the waves. Click on CH2 and drag to fit. Voltage and frequency of A2 is displayed on the right side. We will perform the same experiment to measure capacitance, resistance and generate a square wave using Python interpreter. At the Python prompt, type import expeyes.isj and press enter. Type p equal to expeyes.isj.open and press enter. To display the capacitance value, type p 
dot measure underscore cap and press enter. Capacitance value is displayed on the terminal. To display the resistance value, type p dot measure underscore res and press enter. Resistance value is displayed on the terminal. To generate a square wave, type from pylab import asterisk and press enter. Type ion and press enter. Type print p dot set underscore sqr1 within brackets 100 and press enter. Here 100 is the frequency of the square wave. Type t comma v equal to p dot capture within brackets 6 comma 400 comma 100 and press enter. Type plot within brackets t comma v plot within brackets t comma v generates a square wave on a new window. Press enter. Let us summarize. In this tutorial, we have learnt Introduction to Python Measure AC voltage using plot window and Python Generate a sine wave Measure external and internal voltages using Python Measure capacitance and resistance using plot window and Python Generate a square wave Show connections and circuit diagrams for our experiments as an assignment, measure the resistance of your finger using plot window. Using Python, generate a combination of sine and square waves. Show circuit diagrams for the above experiments. This video summarizes the spoken tutorial project. If you do not have good bandwidth, you can download and watch it. We conduct workshops using spoken tutorials and give certificates. Please contact us. The Spoken Tutorial Project is funded by NME ICT MHRD Government of India. This tutorial is contributed by Kaushik Datta and Madhuri Ganpati. Thank you for joining.